19-year-old Warriors ready to go at it at lightweight. In our second let's get fight up and let's get evening, it John away, fans. This is WLC Lightweight Action. Five three-minute rounds coming to you first, fighting out of the blue corner. Introducing this man has a 15 wins, one loss, and five draws. Hailing from Mon State, Myanmar. Give it up for him. And his opponent fighting out of the red corner. This man holds a record of 12 wins, two losses, and six draws, and comes to us from the Cayenne State, Myanmar. Ladies and gentlemen, put it up for Danza! And your referee in charge of the action, Major Overall. Well, there's no doubt who the home fans are going to be rooting for tonight. Tan Zor in the red corner, 12, 2 and 6. He comes from a family of fighters. He's the little brother of a former fighter, Semen Mong Mong, and big brother of current fighter, So Win Tan. Family affair, let way action. So many of these athletes grow up embedded in the culture of let way. It is life for so many. It's so much easier to be life when your family is involved, when your dad's involved, your kids, your, uh, me, your brother's involved, things like that. It's so much easier to just every day live that life. Here we go, round one, lightweight, five, three minute rounds. Oh, he is coming after him now. Hain, Tun Ong, really stalking now. Tan is off the back foot, he's gotta be careful. Hain is vicious. Hain is considered one of the toughest in his class. They said he never quits. He never goes down. Look at this lion. Headbutt leads in just outside the ropes. And they're tussling and they're wrestling. The referee's letting them play. I love it. Just until they got too tied up. And then he brings them back what? to the center. Major, good job. Big right hand fall by that hand. Big start from Hain. You mentioned the resilience. He's famed for it. And there's a big elbow as well. Oh my Couple, God. And an uppercut to Boot. Come Another on, elbow, then the knee. Oh, God, it's Fishy's in the corner. Look at him go to work. What a start from Hayne against the fighter from Parhan. Works to the body. Khan is in trouble. He finally gets out of, the, out of that corner. Devastating. Look at Han, he's all in the breeze. Two minutes left. It's a lifetime for Khan right now. There he is, right off the top. Great kick. Blocked by, uh, blocked by Hein. Hein with a big right hand. Good head movement from Tan Zor. He's, he's come back into it a little bit, Teddy. Yeah, he's finally woken up after getting a barrage in the corner. My God, WLC, are you not entertained? These are modern day warriors, gladiators, if you will. Oh, he's got a nice headlock right there. Oh, man, that's a schoolboy headlock. Videos of some money, my man. <laughs> wow. Old he might have cut him in the recess line. Oh, big right hand. Haynes come out here with bad intentions. Like he owes him some money. He's throwing a few headbutts as well. I love the way he turtles up like that. That yeah. defense. Three limbs up to be able to decimate that power. Another head kick. Now we see Tan getting into the boat. Yeah, the and what, and yeah. what really was the, the motion from the hometown Tan Zor. But it's edging so, forward from Hain, isn't it? He's not going to stop. He won't stop. Can't stop, won't stop. Here we, here we go. Defense now, great Muay Thai clinch. Snaps the head down, comes up with a knee. Leading with that jab. He is chasing him, look at that. Tries to, tries to check the kick. Intelligence by Tan to sweep underneath to the opposite leg. And like I said, takedown score so high in the eyes of the judges. Hey, again, the aggressor. It's Tan moving back, but he's done really well with the teeth. Tan. Hain is in trouble whether he does it or whether he doesn't. If he doesn't lift that kick up, he's going to take a lot of, of that power right to the leg. If he lifts it up, he gets swept on a beautiful sweep right down the back pipe. Worcester to Boston here in the Cayenne State. Woo! <laughs> another, another headlock takes him down. Round one in the book. Wow. That's another very strong start to the fight as well. The action has been 
stunning right from the outset here tonight, Teddy. Did you expect anything less from WLC8? I sure as heck did not. Wow. I mean, let's just see if he has the gas tank, though, for the five rounds to keep that pressure going. There's an elbow over the top. This is when he really started going to work. Good head kick, great defense. Good head kick, better defense, though, in that one right there. But let's just see if he can keep that going, that stalking, that prowess. It's going to wear on him. It's also going to wear on Tom. Yeah, you almost feel as if Tom's holding back something. So we're alluding to the fact that maybe Tan is holding back, but that's unusual in that way. The gas tank always in question, but the cardio of these fighters is just on another level. Absolutely, they're just machines. But it is a five round fight, and if he's not taking too much damage, he could be downloading the information, processing the kicks, Second processing out. the way Second that he's doing face, ring, and he might unload Second in out. round three, more of a Muay Thai style, maybe or he's just in trouble. But it was a good call on you, you're right. He's not necessarily in trouble if he's playing that rope-a-dope game. Kane very Seconds much out. living up to his Seconds fearsome out, reputation. I mean, you're gonna fight this guy, you better pack a lunch, man. It's gonna be a long day. You know what I mean? Pack a tent. Here we go. Is this just round two, Andrew? <laughs> I mean, because it seems like it's been a war. It is round two. Look at him going again, Big D. Huge knee from Hayne. What a start to the round again. He's got them in their head, not gets thrown to the ground. WWE style. He just got slammed a little rock bottom. And again, Tane just trying. Oh, a nice headbutt on the inside. Nice. Yo, his, his point tie clinch is on point right now. Oh, he's going to work with a knee. Got him in the corner. Elbow over the top. Rips the body. Tane trying to fight back, and he does. Exchanging with the knee. Oh, Tane again gets him locked up, and it's repeating itself the right. patterns of this fight. He's intelligently wrapping his right uh, his right foot around the inside leg just to make that take that a little bit harder. Smart by me. Oh man, they are just brawling. Good elbow right now. And sharpening up those elbows, inching forward, unleashing another elbow on the chin. And now Tom is letting it go. Tom is finally letting it fly now, and he has to because he's in trouble. That beautiful, beautiful third time he's got that sweep. Excellent time lead with the head. Eats an elbow and a head from, from his opponent. This is back and forth, Andrew. Hayne doing superbly well with the elbows. You saw the headbutt coming out as well. A little more of that action. That's what it's all about here at WLC. We are so impressed with the gentleman in blue shorts. Yep. Tom's got to be careful with that defense. Oh, what a big elbow. He's getting caught when he's dropping, dropping his head, and he's eating these elbows. I don't know how long that's going to that's gonna last for him. There he is again. Drops it. Lowers his eyes, most importantly, and allows a uh, hey, uh -huh, Han to just unload. Uh oh, a little turn of the tables right now, maybe. Big left hand. Oh, Han says, I don't care. Elbow over the top. They're going to war. Gotta love the facial expressions, the reactions, but this huge shot. Oh, wait for that. Now he, oh, good lead with the head. Han finally is able to get to stay up on that sweep and a takedown of his own. Beautiful work. Minute what? left, round two. Ooh, body rip. That looked like it hurt. Oh, no, it did look like it hurt. And he's going to the body again. Yes, what? sir. We saw it, Andrew. Hayne getting a lot Ooh. of love from those uppercuts. Watch me. He's going to go to the body again, isn't he? And he does. Intelligence personified right now from the blue corner. He smells blood. He's going for it. Tom it's struggling. Yes, the body again. That one's just off the hip. Spinning back with the Hail Mary. Yeah, Tom needed a little, or excuse me, uh, Tom needed a little break. Tom going in trouble. Hey, with a big elbow, following up with a head kick, just eluded by Tom. Yeah, he can't just keep dropping his head like that. And a big breath. 
needed to be held up by the ropes. Coming from the red corner, an elation from the blue corner. Tanzo, really, you feel just struggling a little bit with the ferocity of those shots from Hang. He just doesn't have an answer for it. And when he, his normal defense, take a look here, that's a good defense there from Hang. From Hang. But Jack, when he drops his head, the elbows and the knees are wide open. That was a great elbow over the top. And this is when he starts ripping the body here, attacking it, and there's nothing Tom can do but go down and wait for the referee to save him. The corner needs to give him great advice here. He has to stop dropping his head. He needs footwork is what he needs. is in control right now. Out. Two rounds Seven's for sure, I would say, range. Andrew. Two rounds Seconds to zero, out. really. Yes, sir. He's unbelievably only been at this for a couple of years. Incredible busyness, really. He's so active. It's so common with Letway fighters. And this is something he's wanted since he was little. And now he has the stage. He's certainly not squandering this guys. opportunity. I'll oh, tell you oh, one oh. thing, he's making his dad proud right now. A former Letway fighter in his own right, a warrior in his own right. His dad's looking on. Oh. Proud as can be. Three. And, four, and right to the body, head kick. Fury so far. Wow, a big clash to the head. He's digging into that body. Give him some barbecue sauce. He's taking those ribs off. <laughs> My lord. He's going to put all in again. And with a flurry oh. of uppercuts, Tom. Evading, oh, flies in with a headbutt. Yeah. Smart. He might need to throw some haymakers and to get crazy. Big risk, big reward. He might need that right now because he is in trouble. Elbow over the top as he grabs the hand down. Looking after the body and a knee on the way off the ropes. Going to work and get to the ribs. Yeah, it's danger time. And really starting to sense the victory here, but a strong elbow from Tom. Yeah, it's just, it, there's nothing he can do really. He's trying. It's got to be frustrating for the fighter from Myanmar. Another rip to the body. Now he fakes it and goes to the high. Wow! Tatum, he has no time. He has no idea what to do. He's putting so much behind those shots. Again, the gas tank on display is epic from him. This dude is a monster right. at lightweight. Good luck to any one of his opponents. So he lost one time, 15 wins from the corner. in the clinch. That's, that's what makes the stakes so high in WLC. He's trying the elbows now. He knows they can cut him. He might get a win off the cut. He might get a knockout. That is really all that Tom Zoy is doing. Right now he's being a punching bag. Headbutt. Huge headbutt from Hayne. He just flies forward. The momentum but, is stunning. The pace oh. relentless. Oh, another headbutt. Pressure, pressure, pressure. Referee saves him, but only for a second. The poor Hard. attrition, Teddy. My lord, Han, right back in his face. Oh, and now he's going, oh my god, two knees. That, okay, now his eyes are rolling back. Now he's a little, he's not just beat up now. Now he's a little concussed. This is way different. Yes, the referee saw it. Gives him the standing eight, finally. I saw it as well. That knee really did. 
take his take his gas. Uh, excuse me, take but, his wits away from him. Andrew. Well, how is he still standing? Yeah. How is warrior. he still standing? Yes, he's a warrior. But this is unbelievable. This is the true Kyan spirit. That's what we're seeing right now. The spirit of a warrior. Round three in the book. Are you not entertained? My God, are you kidding me? Han Tun Ong in the blue, Ben Zong in the red, three rounds in the books, and it has been a massacre. What a performance. He's going to have to dig deep surely because the massive elbow, then the knee to the body, follows up with a hook. And he did have moments done. He's certainly been impressed in flashes, but this has been Kane's fight. There's the elbow, leads him with the headbutt. That's a nice right hand. There's another headbutt. He started doing that in round three, Andrew. He started seeing that the defense had to have that, and that's what gave him the eight. Right there, now he's fighting back. Myanmar spirit coming alive, but it's not enough. I don't think so. I think it's three nil here in the devastating fashion as well. The only thing, Tan, it seems to me, is he hopes Kane, or Han, excuse me, gets his gas tank and just, it just uh, can't keep going. But look at him, he looks fine. He looks fresh. And can we just real quick give it up to the DJ? Real quick, Andrew, this DJ is rocking this house here. Woo! WLC on fire! Just our <laughs> second fight! Woo! I'm sweating Seconds through. Uh, I'm sweating ready. through this shirt. It is a hot night yes, in Par on, and there is fire in oh, guys, the out. ring. The action has been sensational. But you gotta love the showmanship and the pageantry yeah. that comes with it from the walkout, oh, the music, the entertainment is very high indeed. We love it. Now, Tan, where is he gonna get this from? How are you? He's gonna have to dig deep Wait. to get back into this fight. The judges' scorecards surely lopsided in favor of Pain. He's gonna have to stand him, he's gonna have to stun him to gain some respect back. There is no respect. Everything that uh, Han is throwing is hitting, and he's leaving himself wide open. He can care less. So he's got a stick, he's got to an elbow, high kick, he's got to rock his opponent. But he's just rocked in the corner, another headbutt! Beautiful finish work, it was a big knee to the body. Such Such power again. behind yeah. his shots. Just 57 to 60 kgs, but they are warriors. There's a headbutt, but Tom goes down again. Tom Zong in oh. trouble the entire fight. This kid, Tom Tong, is a monster in the blue. Gotta love that uppercut to the body. That's right. a lovely yeah. hook to the body to follow up yeah. as well. Yeah. Oh. So you want to be a fighter, huh? Look at the adversity that this kid is going to have to come back from. Tan One, is in trouble. Gives two, him another eight right now. Three. Hain Tun on okay. with the swagger. Five, yeah, obviously. Six, seven. Eight. So you're saying it's a ten count in San Andrew. So when the fighter goes down and comes back off for the fans, he gets a ten count out of eight. I apologize to the fans for that. That's why Andrew Whitelaw gets the big cut. Spinning back elbow. We said he had to dig deep. And he's, he's he got caught on the one, way in. And two, I, I said he's three, gonna have to throw those, right? Four, and then he gets eight, caught on the way five, in. So you gotta admire it though. Six, yeah, of course. Seven, but it's everything. Eight, he's just there's levels to the game, and we're looking at two different levels now. Records are the same, weight's the same, so the matchmakers had a great matchup, but this is just next level for Han Tun Long. Going to work again, right. knocks him out of the ring! Cannot get, over, cannot get over this Brazilian yeah. shown. He's a warrior, true warrior of all fighters. Wow, big breath. Han Tun Long must be like, what do I need to do to this guy to knock him out? He's knocked him down a ton. A great left hand. Now a right hand. Oh, that kick bucked him up in. All right to the jaw. Left hand lands right around the guard. Now with a big knee, two knees. Tom has been in trouble for literally 20 minutes. Two massive knees to the body. Then the head kick. Surely hands and all is wondering what he's going to do to put him away. The beautiful brutality is on display. Not on the side of the red corner. But 
He, do, he just he dropped just to miss that knee. He dropped just to take oh. that clear the left side. Plus damage. Oh, what a headbutt. Massive in. headbutt oh again. Oh, my God. Thank you, referee. And that's all she wrote. Ladies and gentlemen, that has to go down as a classic. What a performance from Han Chun Ong. My word, that was special. Domination. And you know what, though? He showed great skill as well. The combinations were landing. The copy box numbers were there. He was pressuring from the get-go, non-stop. Now, great from the red corner as far as his heart, the warrior spirit, the Kai-in spirit, but it was a different level right now. Watch out, lightweight division. Han is coming for that belt. And turn on now taking his record to 16, one and five. Many of the fighters on the card tonight still in their teens. Both these gentlemen 19 years old. They are very much the Letway stars of now and the future. Yes, sir, absolutely. Johnny Knight in the ring is going to let us know the official decision. After four rounds of intense WLC action, the referee has called the end of this fight. To present the prize to the winner, we have the WLC Vice Chairman, Ja Um, and Kennel Plus Ambassador, An Sen. Your winner, via KO in the fourth round. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for the blue corner. Hang to on. Amazing. Live, thanks for joining us on all forms of fighting uh, apps and television stations. I lost that one. I lost that one. I went for it and I failed. It's action with a capital A, isn't it? It's such a pleasure to have this streaming around the world. It's an ancient martial art form in that way that is celebrated in Myanmar and now across the globe as well. It's in a fantastic moment for bare knuckle sports for the culture of Letway is really starting to awaken the interest of spectators from outside of Southeast Asia, and it's a pleasure to be part of it with World Letway Championship. What they're doing here is something quite unique.